An uneven range of motion forces your body to work in a way it isn't designed for. Asymmetric movements can even lead to early joint degeneration. With speedy assessment, we can measure cervical range of motion in two different ways. With the first way, we're going to use an iPhone. Start the eye sensor application. Click on New Measurement. Place the iPhone on the head of the patient. The phone should be laid flat on the patient's head with the screen up and the top of the phone pointing in the same direction as the patient's face. Click the left mouse button after each movement or calibration. Look straight ahead. Look left. Look right. Look straight ahead. Left ear to left shoulder. Right ear to right shoulder. Look straight ahead. Look down. Look up. Your test is completed. Well, that was using the iPhone. Now let's see how it works with a webcam. Click on Settings. Then select the tab for Range of Motion. Choose Headband Optical Recognition. Click Setup Position Tracker. Choose which movements you would like to assess. Here we're selecting only lateral flexion. Click Configure. Now place the headband on the patient. Click Begin Profiling. Now click on the headband itself. Once the headband is highlighted, click Finish Profiling and then OK. To perform the cervical range of motion test, click on New Measurement. Click Start. Follow the verbal instructions. Look straight ahead. Click left mouse button between movements and calibrations. Left ear to left shoulder. Here you click the left mouse button. Right ear to right shoulder. And again, here you click the left mouse button. Your test is completed. Here you see the results. The traffic lights indicate green, good, yellow or red, need for further examination, as do the colors of the bar graphs. Your webcam needs to be direct show compatible. We recommend the Logitech 9000 Pro as it provides superior quality. With regard to the iPhone, you need a 3GS model or newer.